there's all these different threads and stories, and we we in, we interpret reality through stories. We impose stories on on that to to give meaning, and, and we we f we create this reality based on a meeting point out of our senses and about what we bring to that situation. And I think the corollary to that is that the kind of attention that we bring to experience modifies what we see out of it. Obviously. When I look at a mountain, I see certain things, and you as a painter might be noticing all kinds of things. You might be, um, I just had a painter friend bring up to me how mountains in the distance often have a bluish tint, which I'm sure you well know, but I hadn't really thought about because I, I'm not paying attention to it. But that, that information was available for me at any time. I just didn't reach out and grab it. So I guess the, to end this talk, I think for me, one of the reasons it's so important to create these stories and to help people share them is that I feel like when you let people share in a different story, you, you focus their experience in a different way than they would if they weren't listening to that piece of music. And I think the, if I could do one thing with a piece of music, it could be to allow people to find something different in their reality. Uh, so much of this music has elements of the familiar in it. All these different um, styles are all just the sounds of twigs and stuff like that. And, um, you know, I, it's so great to be at the Academy, which is so much great research going on. And there's so, so much of that is about explaining things. It's about taking things that are uh, unfamiliar and then making them familiar through a process of el elucidation. And, and that's very important, but it's only one aspect of experience. And I think one of the things that music can do is it can take aspects of experience that have become over familiar or perhaps dulled and, and um, make them unfamiliar again. So on that note, let's all go have a drink. So thank you very much. Thank you.